finally took the time to just you know chalk down all of your requests all the products you want me to try out i actually have three huge cardboard boxes are like literally stuffed with product from all the way around i could get literally covered in them if i show you all at one and i will take you through the products one by one so without me rambling any further about this and making you all fall asleep let's go ahead and quickly start off with the video and you grab yourself a popcorn a coffee and enjoy the haul so i will first go to the makeup part because i feel that is more exciting i mean who doesn't like makeup this is the first box and you can see it's stuffed with product and i will just pick them up so the very first thing i'm going to start off are with the foundations because i have bought a lot of foundations a lot of you guys requested so many foundations to try out so i picked up almost all of them whichever you guys requested because i wanted to try them out and i want to see how they work so the very first foundation as per all of your request is the LA Girl Pro Coverage HD High Definition Long Wear Illuminating Foundation and this is how the product look. The price of this foundation is rupees um, 1250. The shade I bought it in is warm caramel and this is how i really like i feel the shade is gonna be good for my skin tone but it could be slightly darker but i do not know yet because unless i try this out i really cannot say anything product again on all of your request will be this la colors truly matte long wear high pigment foundation but sadly i think the shade i bought is slightly lighter for my skin tone but i went through the reviews and in the reviews they mentioned that the foundation oxidizes a lot so i bought the shade warm honey for my skin tone and it is a shade lighter but if it oxidizes a lot as per the review then it should match my match my skin tone afterward let's see i'm really skeptical but hope it work but can't wait to try them out of course i bought is a much 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 forever requested to me by you guys is finally the milani Conceal and perfect two-in-one foundation plus concealer yes i finally bought this product it in the sheet uh oh where is the shade sand beige 06 i feel the shade is close to my skin tone but somehow the undertone could be slightly lighter because it almost have a beige undertone and i have more warmer tone so again unless i apply it on my skin i really cannot uh, you know say how well it will work i bought so of course since i bought in like three new foundation and uh, i need to buy new primer as well so the first primer which i finally purchased is the nyx studio perfect photo loving primer and it is supposed to be a do for the smash box primer it also looks the same i thought of trying this out because i've heard a lot of good things about this product the price of this primer is rupees 1300 primer i bought is another one which is again highly requested by a lot of you guys and that will be the la girl pro prep primer a lot of you guys requested me to try out more la girl products so i tried to pick some product from la girl which i'm really really looking forward to try product i'm talking about without much suspense is going to be the nelf perfecting lighting waterproof hydrating primer so the pri price of this primer is rupees uh huh uh huh 500 i got it around rupees 450 i think it was in discount again but the thing is that when i bought the primer and even if you just see the primer on the website it will look like a white creme based primer find out that the primer is actually a silicon based primer it is no way a white creme based primer it is a complete complete silicon based primer it is also mentioned on the packaging that it has dimethicone into it so yeah that made me really really excited about the product because you know i was a bit skeptical seeing all that lighting thing then again the reviews it made me all confused and weird i'm gonna move on is to concealer because of course i shared some foundation some primer the next change or the next product should be a concealer because i told you i bought in new products for my basis so i bought two new concealers which are again highly requested by a lot of you guys so the concealer which is highly requested by all of you are the nyx edge 
HD Studio Photogenic uh, Concealer and Corrector. This in the shade CW 6.3. It was called Fresh Beige in the site and also in the package. So this is a concealer. I heard so many good things about this concealer. I thought maybe finally this could just, you know, help me to get over my Fit Me because I'm like all over Fit Me all the time. It's like Fit Me just come and fit me in my life. You know, it's like everywhere fitted in my life. So I really want something which will just, you know, push me from that comfort zone of Fit Me and LA Girl to some new product. So yes, I'm really looking forward to try this product out. The second concealer is also a highly requested one and a very affordable drugstore brand which is a new launch in Nykaa and that will be the Wet n Wild concealer. Yes, a lot of you guys did requested me to try this one as well so I bought it and this is in the shade medium towny or twiny or tiny or anything it's towny i think it's medium towny or twiny anything so yes this is the next product i bought powder this is not a new setting powder this is a miss claire setting powder in shade tl4 the reason i bought this one because the old one is finally empty yes i finally out of god's grace was able to empty out a powder product because trust me it's difficult to empty out powder product so i'm so happy probably it's because it's a loose powder and i used it like hell in last few of my makeup tutorials since i bought in some new base product of course i wanted to try out some new makeup fixer from the market so the first makeup fixer i bought in is a makeup revolution amazing makeup fixing spray this is a really good makeup fixing spray because i know that already because i've tried this uh, from one of my friend earlier i bought and the price of this one is a rupees 1000 and the next makeup fixer i bought is a due for the nyx um, setting spray and this this is a Miss Claire Matte Finish Long Lasting Setting Spray. I really love wanted to try this product out because it it is a due for the next one and I really wanted to see how well it works even though I didn't try the next one but you know this was more affordable I also wanted to buy something within the 500 rupees price range so that when I do you know affordable products for you guys I have a whole set of product to try out because you know everyone has their own budget I do not want to miss on a certain budget because I'm buying another budget of my choice I bought another new bow bow wow Bow wow. bow wow it's oh my god bow wow brow that is a good rhyming from such a weird poet you know just let's just ignore that so this is a, a new bra product so Nika had been giving out some amazing discounts on Wednesday on L'Oreal product so I saw that they have been giving out discount on the L'Oreal brow artist genius kit and the price was rupees 500 so discounted the amount to 50% and the price was just 500 I bought it because you know 500 is a good deal for a brow product because pack eye brow kit which is something I really love is also priced around rupees 450 and I really like that so yeah 500 is decent and really nice amount to invest on a brow powder so I bought it. This product I bought are two mascaras. So the first one will be the new launch Maybelline Colossal Big Shot Volume Express Mascara. This is a new launch from Maybelline and I bought it because you know new launch from Maybelline, a new mascara. I wanted to try a new mascara as well because you know all new product why not a mascara. So I bought this one and of course I also bought another of my push-up drama because my current push-up drama is emptied out. I used it so much. Yes I emptied it out. So the next product I bought is something I'm super excited because of the launch in the Indian market and this is the Maybelline Master Chrome Highlighter in the shade Molten Gold. The price of this highlighter is only rupees 550. Can you imagine it? Because in Insta stores, they used to charge rupees 1200 for them because they have to ship out and they have to pay all the custom and everything. Thank God I never bought from them because you know, a lot many times I was really, really almost buy it from an insta store because it looked so beautiful finally also launched the new set of metallic lipsticks the matte metallic range and i bought or picked up two shades from the range because you know metallic lipsticks and glossy lips are again back in trend i was quite impressed because they have some really unusual and unique color and if you guys really know me a bit you know that i am an unusual person myself so usually unusual colors really really attracts me to bits i mean if you are a old fam member you have been in my channel from really old times you will know this that you know anything unusual weird abnormal attracts me first hand so yes the first color therefore i picked up do not require any introduction because this is the color gunmetal and i loved this color i mean this is sort of a very beautiful and gorgeous 
you know indigo sort of a bluish deep greenish indigo kind of a shade i mean when i looked at this color i was like oh my god i have to use this and still now when i'm looking at it i'm just thinking oh my god where i'm gonna put you on my lips i so need to use you i just cannot wait mm. i know you might think that i'm overreacting but trust me i love makeup and being a person who love makeup makeup really makes me excited and weird i mean in my normal life i sometimes scare my parents with such weirdness so you know you can understand so the second color is a very beautiful copper color it is a metallic copper shade and the shade is called copper rose and this is a very very beautiful copper color a metallic copper color i've been planning to buy such a metallic color in copper from such a long time so when i saw one in maybelline i picked this up i'm really excited to try both of this out but the only thing which you know sort of what can i say you know disappointed me is again their same packaging i mean these are like matte metallics they could go around and experiment a bit you know maybe like glitter caps or metallic caps or shiny caps but no it's the same old packaging so the packaging game is really getting boring by the day but yeah the colors are definitely interesting and nice and the shade range is definitely something unique in the indian market i feel now the next product i have is this miss claire uh, matte and pearly gloss and this is in the shade 111 it's a very beautiful matte pearly red gloss and i got it free with my miss claire powder because there was some uh, offer going on my shadow i bought is a international product and this is another of you guys know how much i love juvia's so i had the masquerade the nubian to the mama my papa now i needed the beta magic with my life so yes beta magic is with me now and i think beta magic is now telling me to go for sister festival you know it's not happening it's totally not happening you need to wait for your sister to arrive you were too much demanding so yeah i bought this first you know magic palette by juvia's and i bought it from the store called international makeup it is an insta store but international makeup actually have their own online website so you can directly go to their website and place the order of the product and as mentioned by them on their insta page itself the order gets delivered within seven working days which is super amazing because she is really helpful she respond quite well and also help you out with any issues in case you have any question with the orders as you can see and once i open this and yes i dropped the plastic this is how it looks do you see the beauty oh my god this could literally literally make me faint i mean juvia's is really make me crazy best part was that she actually sent me a gift along with this palette and that will be this is a product which i did not show from the previous box this clen color baked highlighter this is a very very beautiful silver icy silver icy cold highlighter i was really looking forward to grab one you know silver ice cold looking highlighter like this one for myself blingy highlighter let me tell you just look at this just for once i'm showing you and clan color is a very nice affordable international drugstore brand in case you guys do not know just letting you guys know so when i last introduced the huda desert dusk palette a lot of you guys did talk about the bad habit palette and bad habit is actually an international drug store brand comes up with this amazing gorgeous and pigmented dupe for the huda palettes because i have seen like bloggers people raving about them with such similar consistency and since i already owe a huda palette i thought if i buy a bad habit palette it will be really amazing and easy for me to compare because you know i have tried their desert dusk so i really know how their formula is how the texture is i bought a dupe for that one so i bought the bad habit after hours palette this is supposed to be a dupe for the huda beauty move obsession palette which is like so beautiful the best part is the price of this palette is only rupees 1200 while you know if you buy huda the price will be around 2900 this is how the product look as you can see it is such a beautiful set of colors the exact colors the exact shade whatever is present in the huda move so i bought this one also from the international makeup store and yeah she does you know keep bad habit palettes with her 
Now the next two palette I'm going to show our drugstore palette and the first palette will be from NYX. So I really do not have any NYX eyeshadow palette till date. So this time I made my mind that I have to pick up a NYX palette. I have to. So I picked up this NYX professional makeup ultimate multi finish eyeshadow palette and I absolutely love this shade color. This is in the shade smoke screen. It has three similar colors in each row but each of these colors are in different textures. You have the matte, satin and shimmer texture so you get to create like beautiful monotone looks or even like mixing all of them together you can really play around with this textures in amazing way so I picked up this LA girl blush collection it is sort of a face palette from LA girl and I bought it in the shade glam so it has two beautiful matte pink shades and a beautiful bronzer and a highlighter but the reason I picked up this palette is because of the matte blushes and the bronzer rest me plus the color of the bronzer looked really really warm and nice for my skin tone so I thought why not try another LA girl product since it looks very very pocket friendly and everything and pretty packaging is of course another of the reason move on to the final box which consists of all the skincare product which I have in this haul and all of them are stuffed together in this huge box and again these are like mostly requested skincare products now so the very first skincare product I'm going to pick up is a big dabba and this is a L'Oreal Skin Expert Pure Clay Mask Exfoliate and Refine Pores 3 Pure Clay plus Red Algae. So a lot of you guys did wanted me to try out the L'Oreal Clay Mask. I wanted to try out the Charcoal Clay Mask but it was sold out. So I picked up this one the red one which is for exfoliating and refining pores which will work well for me I feel because I want to clean up my pores really good. What I bought is another face mask and this is the Innisfree Super Volcanic Pore Clay Mask. If you guys have seen my previous, uh, you know, winter skincare routine where I've used the Volcanic Pore Capsule Recipe Pack, you will know I've said it in that video only that I wanted to pick up this one because I wanted to buy this product from Mumbai itself but I couldn't because the product of out of stock at that time in the store. But I finally picked it up because this product worked really well onto my skin so I will definitely use this and looking forward to try this more. Very interesting skincare product it is sort of a makeup yet skincare so I've included it in the skincare list and this is also a powder product so this is a Lacme Sun Expert Sun wow Lacme Sun Expert ultra matte compact non-sticky sun formula sunscreen in a compact form I saw this product in Nike I was so impressed I felt if this product worked well this could be a perfect product for someone who is going to school or going to college I picked up a Khadi face pack because the packaging of the face pack looks very interesting this this is a Khadi Herbal Face Pack in Fruit. I really wanted to try a Fruit, fruit Face Pack. So this is one I bought and probably I will do a first impression or a review video on this one and let you guys know how it works. What are from the brand uh, Biotic because a lot of you guys have been requesting me to try out more products from Biotic. So I bought like three to four products from Biotic and the first product I bought is a Biotic Bio Honey Gel Refreshing Foaming Face Wash. This is a honey face wash and this is for all skin type and this is the reason I bought it because you know if I be picking up a product only for oily skin I don't feel it could serve the purpose for someone with dry skin. So I picked up a product which is suitable for all skin type so that no matter which skin type you are into you can still try out the product bio papaya revitalizing tan removal scrub i have already used their clay mask which i absolutely love because you know i have a thing for clay and earth thing i already told you before now the reason i bought the tan removal scrub because i feel summer month is in and everyone really really worries about tan so if a product this affordable could work well on tan nothing is better than that so I really wanted to give this a try and see how well it works. That I bought from Biotic is a face serum because I thought inst I already have a face moisturizer and a body moisturizer so I didn't want it to go for cream and this is a Biotic Advanced Star with a Dandelion Visibly Ageless Serum it's visibly repairs and rebalances skin I have seen some really good review about this product in the uh, you know comment section for oily skin people so that is why I wanted to try this out Biotic Advanced Ayurveda Bio Seaweed Revitalizing anti fatic Eye Gel this is kind of an eye gel which will relax your eye after a day of work someone who work a lot in front of bright lights in front of system so my eyes get really really stressed out I bought is a charcoal collagen essence mask from this brand called Dermal I was looking for this Dio Packer charcoal mask but it is always out of stock so I bought this charcoal mask 
instead to try out i don't know how this brand and this product work this is the first time i'll be trying out any mask from this brand so hopefully this works well but this is what the product looks like now the next thing i bought is this charcoal nose mask this is supposed to be a korean brand i bought from nike this definitely works well because i already used one of them on my nose just to tell you guys but yeah i am really excited because I, if you guys know i have told you before also i like using strip you know nose strips for removing blackheads i already have the innisfree one so this is a new one now the final thing i have here is a free product from innisfree now i was really happy with this kit but also a bit disappointed because one of the product from this kit is missing you know this kind of things happen and i get a bit disappointed like mm, really okay what the heck because just the innisfree aloe revital special kit which i got free with this you know super volcanic clay mask and it consists of a green tea fish not a green tea sorry aloe revital facial mist uh, aloe revital sleeping pack and also it's supposed to include an aloe revital soothing gel and the gel is missing so i'm supposed to manage that from aloe vera plant directly so yeah deal with it Anywho, that is pretty much all the product which I have in this huge, huge haul. Guys, really enjoyed this haul video. Let me know which products you want me to do first. If you like this video, please make sure that you hit the like button, give it some love. Please do subscribe to my channel because that will really mean a lot to me. And of course, I will see you guys soon. Until next time, take care. Bye.